Good morning, Munaki. Please join me in the saying of the Pledge of Allegiance to the flag. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you. Hello, my name is Daniel. Hi, my name is Ashley. My name is Camilla. The qualification that I have to become an elf is that I'm, I'm a fast worker. I be, come up with good ideas. I usually help my mom with the decorations all the time. And I, I just like to work. Well, I'm good at wrapping presents and I'm very like nice. And I will be good for like helping Santa and I wake up really early in the morning. And that's it. Well, I'm always creative. Um, I always have a lot of fun. I'm never sad and stuff. The characteristic that I have is that I'm funny. I can help people. I'm caring. I can do something really fast. Well, I'm really good with like Santa. I think I would be good, like a good worker. I would think like I would be like I could communicate a lot with the elves, like very good. Well, I could make toys that could be in either language because I speak both Spanish and the English. If I became the elf, I think I'd help Santa with like. I would help him get the presents around the world and I would help him like build the presents and I would help just everybody. If I became an elf I would be very proud of myself and happy because it was it would be like really nice to work with Santa and his elves. I would help Santa with making a lot of toys and I'll be a fast worker. I'll um because I'm always creative. And yeah. Have you been waiting for your chance to appear on RLC TV News? Have you been itching to give an announcement? Or to lead the school in the pledge? Did Hank agree to do the lunch with Brian and Jeff? Itching to tell a joke with Joe King? The Joe King? No. <sighs> well, now here's a chance! ROC TV News is excited to announce the guest crew member contest. Each week, we will be selecting a different homeroom. Participating homerooms will be announced on Friday. Your homeroom teachers will have ballots in their mailbox for each and every student. Ballots will be collected and returned to Mr. Keelan's mailbox by the following Wednesday. We will announce the winners of the contest that Friday. Only students who return their Ballot sign will be able to participate. We are also excited to announce our first participating homeroom. This carry If your homeroom is selected, make sure you get your slips in by Wednesday. Make sure you get your chance at RLC. Hello, Hello RLC. I'm Coach Meyer. And I'm Coach Meyer. No, I'm Coach Meyer. No, I'm Coach Meyer. We're both Coach Meyer, okay? Yeah. And, and wear your sports, sports guys. guys. Here's your weekly update on what's happening in sports. Let's first look at our local sports. Last week, the girls' basketball team played Fort Lee, sadly. Munaki lost 60-22. Shout out to Morgan, who sunk a big three-pointer. The boys' basketball team played Ringwood and lost. But Brandon Nieves still had a great game leading the team in points. Coming up, the boys basketball team will be playing the Hillsdale team at Pascack Valley High School on Sunday the 21st. This week coming up, girls team will be hosting Den Marist at home on February 25th. Go Lucky Girls! Now in national sports. In hockey, the Devils will be playing the New York Islanders. The Rangers will be playing the Detroit Red Wings. Go Devils! 
Guard in basketball, the Knicks will be playing the Nets. Also, the Nets will be playing the Knicks. What a coincidence. We'll see you next Friday. Until Do then, then, keep sporting. Do it! Good morning, Minaki. Welcome to RLC TV News. She's Toro. And she's Katie. And today is Friday, February 19, 2016. Tomorrow, today's birthdays are me and Madonna in the sixth grade, David Martinez in the eighth grade, and Andrew Schuyler in the fourth grade. Happy, Happy birthday. birthday! But tomorrow's birthdays are Ansel Adam. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Have a great day. Well, what are today's headlines? Today's headlines are, there's a PTO family night from 7 to 9. To yeah. 9? To 9. To 9. To 9. Now, now let's, let's find out what's for lunch with Brian and Jeff. Should we read? Pizza Adventures with Brian and Jeff. Okay, room 27. Got it. Okay. Uh, 26. Ah, 27. Oh, hi! Hey, oh, piece of I'm delivery. I'm so excited for the heat show go. after a hard day of work. Yeah. Oh, thank you so much. I've heard oh, so many welcome. good things about it. It's oh, the best family. pizza in the world. Hey! This is not the pizza I ordered. But I ordered one with mushrooms. I thought this was the best pizza place in the whole town. It is. This I can't is believe not, this. No, no mushrooms? No mushrooms. How could you forget the mushrooms? Oh, no. I that means... This was, what? That means what? Jeff. I, I need to take this back right yes, away. To get me I am so pizza. sorry, ma'am. Thank you. Mmm, mmm, that sounds really good. That pizza sounds really good. That sounds delicious. I cannot wait until lunchtime now, my friends. My friends. My friends. My friends. The you are all our friends. Yes. Okay. The word of the day is photograph, which means a picture made using cameras in which an image is focused onto film or other light sensitive material. As in, when I go to my favorite place, I take a photograph for a memory. I'm going to take a photograph of this is because it's a really good memory. Yeah, of us filming some RLC TV. Say cheese! <laughs> are we Fact of the day is, there are 250 million photos uploaded to Facebook daily, but Instagram trails behind with 40 million mobile uploads a day. That's still a lot. That is still 40 million. a lot. Boy, how many people. Upload to social media these days. Like Think me. Think before you post. Like me. Think before you post. Yeah, because internet safety is a great thing. Now let's hear a joke with joking. I really love Frozen. I hear you like Frozen. I cannot respect that. It's you're like a five-year-old girl. Or a boy. A boy. A boy can like Frozen too. Any gender could like anything. Just saying. Um. Okay, I'm gonna tell you a frozen joke. Why can't you give Elsa a balloon? Why? Can't you give Elsa a balloon? Because she'll let it go. <laughs> well, that's all for now. We'll be back on Monday with more news and fun. Until then, stay memorable, Munaki, and have a picture of a day.